What we understand at this point is that early this morning, one of the residents went out front and there was a package on the front doorstep. They brought that package inside the residence and as they opened that package, both victims were in the kitchen and the package exploded, causing the injuries that resulted in the young man's death and the injuries to the adult female. The incident is very similar to the incident that occurred in Austin back on March 2nd. And if you'll remember, that incident also occurred in the morning hours when uh, the victim in that case went out front and found a package on their front steps that exploded, uh, causing that in individual's death. That, in that case was being investigated as a suspicious death. It is now being reclassified and is now a homicide investigation as well. And as I've said, we do see similarities and believe that these cases are linked at this time. However, we don't know what the motive behind these may be. We do know that both of the homes that were the recipients of these packages um, belonged to African Americans. So we cannot rule out that hate crime is at the core of this, but we're not saying that that's the cause as well. We're just acknowledging and we're looking at any possible motivations that would link these two cases together. If you've received a package that you were not expecting, that is not from someone that you expected to receive a package from, or for some reason gives you cause for concern, then call 911 until we've gotten to the bottom of this and cleared these cases. We are not going to tolerate this in Austin and you have seen every stop will be pulled out and the federal agencies have all jumped in with us to lend us a hand and to bring this to as quick of a resolution as possible.